Nantes camping is very convenient for the city centre. It's about 175 kilometres from San Malo ferry. That's around 110 miles. And it took me just about two hours to get here. The site is set in a long wooded valley. So when I awoke this morning, I was greeted by a cacophony of birdsong. It's lovely here. Let me show you around. The staff at reception speak excellent English, and here you will find information on the city, cycle hire, the Nantes Pass, bus and tram tickets. The tram stop is just across the road from the site, and a half hour ride will get you into the centre. Walking takes around 45 minutes. Just across from reception is the site restaurant where you can eat in or take away. It serves terrific pizzas and bistro style food. A security barrier gives you access to the site's 84 spacious pitches, which are a mix of grass and hard standing. All are level and have electricity and water. Behind the touring area is a towpath that's ideal for walking dogs, cycle rides or going for a run. The two wash blocks with separate facilities for men and women comprise a laundry, dishwashing, toilets and showers, including facilities for the disabled. There's also a drive over service point. There's mini golf and a small children's play area. And across the road is a leisure centre where Nantes camping guests have free use of the large swimming pool. For keeping in touch, Wi-Fi is available throughout the site. If you only want to stop for one night, there is also an air here, which can accommodate 15 vans and has its own drive over service area. Let's find out what other people think. This is our fourth night um, and it's just been wonderful. The campsite is exceptionally good, better than what I thought. We were here 30 years ago and it was uh, not so good, but they've done it all up and it's uh, excellent. And it's so near the town as well and uh, the facilities of the tram into the town is excellent. I think the site is very, very good. Um, the, the facilities are superb. Um, yeah, and not many, there's a lot of private sites we've been on that are nowhere near as good as this as a municipal site. Um, it's, it is almost faultless. It is a really, really good site. Nantes camping is open all year, but finding a site that is open during the low season can be tricky. An alternative would be camping La Pandia at Eric, which is about half hour's drive from the centre. I have thoroughly enjoyed my stay at Nantes Camping and I've made good use of the site's restaurant and the tram to get into the city centre because driving around the centre in a motorhome isn't easy. I've loved riding the big elephant and the carousel on the Ile de Nantes. Nantes is an interesting and vibrant city with enough art and culture to have me coming back for more, but now I have a ferry to catch. <laughs>